Hello Hotshow and welcome to today's lesson on averages. So by the end of today's lesson you should be able to calculate and find the mean and the range. The keywords for today are mean, median, mode, range and average. So the real life link is for scientific experiments for finding the average and for range would be in the general census which the government send out to your families, to homes to find out general information for ages in households. Okay, our first example. To find the mean of this set of data, two dice were thrown ten times and their scores were added together and recorded. Find the mean for this set of data. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. We have ten bits of data, yeah? Ten scores. So to find the mean, the mean equals the sum of all scores divided by number of scores divided by number of scores okay to find the sum of all the scores what that means is we're going to add up all the scores so I'll be 7 plus 5 plus 2 plus 7, plus 6, plus 12, plus 10, plus 4, plus 8, and plus 9. We're going to add them all up, and we're going to divide it by the number of scores. Again, we have 10 scores, so I'm going to divide it by 10. Okay? Now, that will give us 7. That becomes 70 over 10, which is 7. Okay? That equals 7. Okay, so what I would like you to do is to find the mean of the following data and once you're finished, return to the video and I'll show you how to do it. Okay, welcome back. So let's recall the formula for mean. Mean equals sum of all scores or data divided by the number of or data okay so what I'm going to do is I'm going to add up all the numbers to give us the sum and let's check how many number of scores we have we've got one two three four five six so I'm going to divide that by six okay now if we add up all the values in the numerator that will give us 78 divided by six which is equals to 13. Our answer is 13. Okay, can you please have a go at finding the mean of this data? And once you're finished, return to the video and I'll go through it myself. Okay, welcome back. So the answer to this question is 24.5. Add up all the values and divide it by. 8 because there are 8 bits of data okay now we are going to move on to range okay the range is the difference between the largest and smallest score okay <coughs> two dice were thrown 10 times and their scores are added together and recorded these are the scores here okay find the range for this set of data so at the bottom you'll see the range is the largest value take away the smallest value. The largest value in this set of data is 12 and the smallest data is 2. The smallest is 2, the largest is 12. So what I'm going to do is 12 take away 2 equals 10 so our range is 10 largest value take away smallest value okay can you please have a go at calculating the range for this set of data once you're finished come back and I'll go through it myself okay welcome back so the range is equals to the largest take away the smallest and the largest is 18 
the smallest is 8. So that is 18, take away 8, which is 10. Okay, can you please have a go at working out the range for this set of data? Once you're finished, come back and I'll give you the answer. Okay, welcome back. The largest number is 37, the smallest one is 15, so the range is 22. Okay, we'll now come on to the main task. What I would like you to do is I want all classes in all sets to do 3 from red, 2 from orange, and I would like you to have a go at 1 green, at least 1 green. Okay? If you have any questions, message me on class charts. Can you please take a picture of your solution and upload them onto class charts? Good luck.